Bulgarian and Pona and we are now on the other coastal side of Italy on the Adriatic Sea. Antona is a big port town and you can get a lot of the ferries across to Greece and across the other side of the sea from here. The water is crazy blue here so after we have spent the day in Ancona we are headed to the Convera del Riviera. It's like uh, the really beautiful coastline the whole way down of beautiful rocky beaches and yeah it's meant to be really spectacular. cathedrals at the top of the city on the hill so it literally looks over the whole town it's beautiful we have driven away from Ancuna and we have hit the coast and we are on the Convira Conira we're not Conira. sure Conira Conero I think the bus said Conero Riviera so beautiful coastline so we are parked up for the night, 8 euros in a car park that's secure and we are headed down to a beach. We've got to hike down the cliff I think. Um, so yeah, should be nice. So we are headed to Ma Mar Valley Beach. Yeah, it's meant to be beautiful. So I just found this on the local sign. Tourist off. <laughs> Sorry guys, but we're coming in. Beautiful. A lot of sweaty people going back up. A lot of sweaty people. <laughs> so the only way you can get to this beach is to hike down or on your boat. So hike is the best option, the cheapest. <laughs> it's warm. It's beautiful there. Eh? Going to have a picnic for dinner? Picnic and a view. We're lucky the wine connoisseur. Yeah, I think the bubbles are a bit big on this one. But. Yes, we got told at the winery the other day when you have sparkling wine, it should have really fine and lots of bubbles. And if it, they're big bubbles, the quality is probably not as great. Yeah, so. that's not bad. Like, it's pretty good. That's good. Wow, what a good picnic rug holder you are. Thank you. You've <laughs> done it many times. Mm -hmm. So this morning we have come to Porto Novo. So we were at that beach just over there yesterday afternoon. Something like that, just down the coast. 
from where we were this morning. This afternoon we are hiking to the beach of the Twin Sisters, is it called? Yeah, but we only get to the viewpoint. Yeah, the hiking trail is closed because of landslides the whole way, so we can only get to like a viewpoint, but this is the most iconic beach in the whole Dimash area. So it said it was voted the best beach in Italy. In 2019. Yeah. So, and that apparently was due to like the quality of water, pollution, like all those kinds of things. So it's meant to be really nice. So in the distance, you can just see the beach that we were on earlier today. And you can see Serlo in the distance. You can see the big cathedral church on the hill. So very nice. Amazing. Beautiful. We're down there today. So you can see in the distance there are the twin sisters. So it's called Li Du Sorelli, meaning the two sisters apparently. This morning we are in New Manor and we are checking it out. It's got some really nice beaches and the houses and the little streets are very nice and well kept here. was so cute we decided to sit down and have a coffee it's nice and quiet this morning too so we can head to the beach later this is probably one of the nicer beaches that we've been to in terms of people and rubbish and things, it's pretty nice. And even the pebbles are, like, and getting in and out of the water is, a, is pretty easy with the pebbles. Sometimes that can be a real pain. Yeah, it's a pretty nice beach. Do you agree? Yeah. <laughs> 